Well, this is a very exciting new initiative from UQ and the IMB. Uh, for the first time, we're going to take a community approach to antimicrobial discovery. There are fewer and fewer antibiotics in the pipeline, and there are more and more superbugs which are threatening health. So we're going to work together to discover new antimicrobials and new compounds from the community. So COAD is going to look at molecular diversity. Chemists around the world make molecules for lots of different reasons, but unfortunately they sit on the shelf. This is an untapped resource for the community and for mankind. So for the first time, we'll offer a free screening service. We can discover the next new drug against the superbugs. So the COAD pipeline of screening, uh, we start with QCing the samples, and then we would start with a standard primary screen of escape pathogens, which is um, a small panel of uh, multi-drug resistant um, bacteria of different origins. Once we have any hits in this area, we then back screen for cytotoxicity to make sure that the compounds weren't toxic to human cells. So it is a community approach and this is not for profit. Um, we make no claims to intellectual property. The compound belongs to the person that provided it. But what we're doing is we're unlocking the value. We're showing this compound can actually kill a whole variety of different superbugs and it's still safe against human cells. So this first step of discovering new molecules that can kill these very, very hard to, to beat superbugs is a key step forward. After that, of course, the researcher can then take those results, file a patent, publication, talk to a pharmaceutical company, but we're really helping the community to make that important advance in science.